What is going on today guys? Tomcat here and today I'm bringing you guys another GTA 5 video. Now in this video I'm going to be doing a full off-road build of the Rebel uh, off-road pickup truck in GTA 5. Now this truck is actually interesting. I haven't messed around with it at all really. I've mainly used the Sand King for all of my off-roading but one of my friends told me that I should probably ch at least check this truck out. At least give it a chance. Uh, because since I've never used it so and I don't really know uh, to be honest what it's like so let's see what we can oh wow that looks sweet definitely going for the Baja bars in the front uh, upgrading the engine as far as we can go uh, leave the explosives alone horns I'll get back to them later xenons definitely let's see respray this doesn't get rid of the yeah no it doesn't get rid of any of the like holes or dirt so I'm not even gonna worry about that in fact yeah I'm not even gonna worry about the color for now let's see what else transmission oh definitely going for race transmission didn't even realize I had that unlocked okay so stock bed wide arch bed I oh Baja bed oh dude that's awesome we can even have a Dakar space frame uh, Baja space frame and the sand rail conversion. Uh, the sand rail conversion is really cool, but honestly, I really, really, uh, really like the Dakar space frame. I think that thing looks sweet. Let's see what else. Turbo tuning, definitely. Wheels, let's see. Uh, hmm. Those look pretty cool. Yeah, I think I'll go with these. Let's make them... Let's just make them black. Like, just keep it basic. But I think the black looks really cool, though. Uh, just upgrade the tires just for the sheer look of it. Um, not gonna worry about tire smoke because... I mean, custom tire smoke, you don't really need it on an off-roader. So, bulletproof tires, I don't really need either. Since, again, this is an off-road build. Um... Window tinting I don't really need either, so let's actually go ahead and do sport brakes, though, because, uh, to be honest, you actually need brakes more than you think off-road. Let's see, is there anything else we can do? Not really, I've pretty much upgrade done all the upgrades that I can do, so let's go ahead and take it for a test drive and see how it does. Alright, so we've made it to the off-roading spot that I'm going to test this on today. Um, you'll notice that it is a little bit damaged. Um, there, The AI cars were being really, really evil today. I don't know what it is, but they were like... It felt like they were aiming for me, to be honest with you. But the steering is not damaged. It still goes in a straight line just fine. And the only damage is, is body damage. There's no damage to the engine. So we're all good. It's not like, you know, it's not like the engine's messed up. I mean, the wheels are slightly cambered, but... Oh, God, that's not gone well. That's not what I wanted it to do, honestly. But the wheels are slightly uh, over-cambered, but that's okay, I think, because it doesn't really affect the performance too much. Now, let's see what we can do if we try to tackle this uh, little bit of a hill. I mean, it's, a, it's more than a little bit of a hill. It's pretty decent, and this is uh, tackling it quite well, actually. Now, uh, stop, stop. I'm holding the e-brake. I'm holding the e-brake, and it's still rolling. Still rolling. Yeah, it doesn't want to do it. Let's see if I get maybe a little more speed, maybe have a little bit more flow into the, into the mountain itself. Now, let's see. Come on. Don't flip over. Oh, my God. That's the thing I don't like about this truck, though. It really likes to flip over. Like, I mean, way more than the Sand King. This thing is, like, really, really, really prone to rolling over. Um, and like I said, the Sand King doesn't do it anywhere near as much as this seems to. For some reason. I'm not sure why, uh, to be honest. Because this thing is, you know, it's not any more lifted than the Sand King is. I mean, this is a lot lighter than the Sand King, but also the Sand King is a whole lot more powerful. It's a whole hell of a lot more powerful uh, than, than this thing is. So that might be contributing to the fact that this thing is really, really, really rollover happy. 
But again, I don't know exactly why this thing loves to roll over so much, or so much more than the Sand King does. But, oh, you really have to watch yourself when you're trying to go along a ridge like this, that's for sure. Dang, this is all rock. You could slide off of this any moment. Oh, God. Okay, look at that. Look how skinny that, that actual path is. I'm going to try this, but I'm going to go really, really slowly. Because I feel like there's a really high chance of screwing something up here. Come on. Oh, don't you screw up on me now. Come on. Come on, come on. There we go. There we go. Oh, no, no, damn it, no. No. Well, shit. We, yeah, we just ruined it. There we go, and yeah, we're, we're tumbling, we're tumbling. If we don't blow up, wow, I'm surprised we didn't blow up. I'll be really honest with you guys, that's, I'm surprised we didn't blow up there. I thought we were going to explode. To be honest with you, I thought we were going to freaking explode. Land on the wheels, come on, there you go. Uh-oh, nope, that's not gone well. Oh, crap. Oh, no way, we actually landed that on the freaking tires. That was... Surprising, to say the least. That was quite surprising, to be honest. But I'm afraid we do have an issue. It's known as extreme camber. Uh, that's that's not going to work well for us. That's really, really, really not going to work well. Let's see how this thing's water fording capabilities are. Dang, it went way underwater. Whoo! Oh, God. My driver's leg is, like, sticking outside the door. That's not- that's not the way, the way it's supposed to be. Come on, clear this freaking river. Come on, clear- there we go. No problem at all, really. Wait a minute. Oh, yes. Oh, hell yes. This is gonna be clean. If I can manage it. There's the if in there. That's, like, the thing. That's- If I can manage it. It'll be awesome. If I don't crash. Alright, come on, come on, power, come on. Hit the jump. Go! Oh, no, 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 dang it. That, well, let's see if I can get back across the river, because if I can, I can try it again. Don't die. Oh, whew, I was like, please don't freaking die. Please don't freaking die on me. No! Okay. I'm gonna try this one more time because I feel like I can get it. I feel like I can legitimately, legitimately get this thing over that, um, over that jump. I don't know why I was having such a freaking hard time saying legitimately. I was legitimately having a hard time saying legitimately. Uh, no, 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 we, no, nah, it didn't work. Oh, come on, is it gonna do it? Oh my god, I'm surprised. I am genuinely surprised at what we ju were just able to do there. Dang. That was really crazy. Let's try to attack one more obstacle. And see what... Oh god. Never mind. I guess I was like, and see what we can do. But then again, I, but then I just started rolling over for some reason. I don't, yeah, I don't think we've gone the right way. Oh, and get through the tree. There you go. There you go. Nope. Yeah, this massive camber has caused some really bad understeer. Like, I mean, really, really bad understeer. To the point where it's really, honestly, hard for me to control this thing in any kind of cornering situation. Well, that was unexpected. I thought it was just going to hit the wall. Just climbed right up it, though. Hmm, what do I want to do? What do I... Oh, I know. I know. I know exactly how I want to finish this. If we can climb this hill, then we'll be able to do it. Hopefully, we'll be able to actually climb it. Come on. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Come on, here we go. Uh oh. Nope, nope, nope. Mm mm. Mm mm. Dang it. 
Dang it. Okay, that's not that didn't go the way I wanted it to go. Still, I could get across the river, maybe. Oh, that's wide and deep. Uh, this isn't gonna work. Or is it? It's floating! Oh crap, it's been destroyed. If for the minute there, it was actually floating. That was crazy. That was crazy. I, th I feel like if the shore would have been closer, we would have actually survived that, and the, vi and the uh, vehicle would have actually floated across the river. But that was crazy. So if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave me a like. Tell me in the comment section down below what you thought. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe for more GTA and new games coming very soon. So I will see you guys in the next one. Talk to you guys later. And thank you guys so much for 38 thousand subscribers that is crazy i mean that is like mind-blowingly crazy we are so close to 40k so i will see you guys in the next video